the one that took me to the house now slept with me. After he slept with me, the second one now slept with me again. After the other one slept with him now that took me to the house. I said, I need you three times. That's how I got pregnant. My name is Rejoice Anita, and I'm 18 years old. I'm from River State, Omok. I'm a student. I stopped at SS2. Do you know why I stopped school? There was no money, and actually, I did not grow up with my own parents. My mom died when I was six months. Oh. And my dad married another wife. So, anytime I talk to my dad, he doesn't give me the right answer. And already, I did not grow up with him. I grew up with my auntie. When my mom died, I was staying with my auntie. So, even when I was 16, 17, I was asking my auntie and my uncles that who is my mom and who is my dad. So they did not give me the right answer. They were saying that that I don't have dad, I don't have mom. So normally they normally talk something about me. Like my mom died because of social things, because of sickness and other things. So when I normally ask, nobody gave me the right answer. So one day my auntie, my auntie showed me my dad's house. That's how I went to there and told him for money, for school things and for feeding. So he would give me. He refused. He said I should come back the next day. When I come back the next day now, he said you have already bought everything. But I did not call. Also, I said, okay, bring it, let me take it to the house so that nobody will know that I came to see him. He said, I should go back. Already, I was selling something for my auntie then. So that's the money I was using for my school fees. If I said that's how I was and pay for school fees. So when I asked my dad now that he should give me the money for school things, he said, no. I should go back the next day. I said, okay, daddy, give me money for slippers. He bought the slippers. When he bought the slippers, the slippers was old, old slippers he bought for me. I just get angry and I took the slippers. When I reach home, I drop it. Because I don't want anybody to ask me now who gave me kind of slippers. I just threw it. Then I come back again and told my dad that dad um i want to uh, start going to school later those uh, my step sister some of them have already write the wire finish write everything now they're out of school i told them for school fees you didn't need to apply for anything i said okay that i'm going to, i want to start work since as i have asked you for everything you choose I want to start my own. So I saw a job in Tanzania. That I post work needed. So when I saw it, I said, ah, this through this work, I can use it to complete my school. So when I start doing the work, which is generating work, in new life. So I started doing the business, which is you know I saw this food supplement. So I know I sell all those things. When I think my my dad said I should stop. But I told him that I don't have any money for feeding and other things. He said I should go, I should go. Already if there's one of my uncle, I told about that surprise issue. He refused. He only showed me his nakedness for me to sleep with him. So that was what make me to go out from the house. And when I go out, I start following all this. I now they now carry me straight to tackle. I start doing the business. I saw poster. They put computer operator, POS cleaner, bookkeeping, um, bookkeeping for five thousand, cleaner ten thousand. What they post 
and the work. So that's why I copy it. So when I copy the number down, I now that they are now left, so I not tell anybody. And I left the house and come to Tarkot. Now I start doing the business, the new life business, the supplement business. The reason why I start is so I, I can be saving money for feeding, also, also going to school. But everything fell upside down. I started doing the business. This is a business that you know I go different, different places. Now I go different states for you to do the business or sell. And now we normally travel to you go to any place, we normally ask for assistance for somebody to give us us to stay. That's how we should sleep there and come back to tackle. Now I go to different different places. So region one day I went to um um, um this thing open um Lagos bus cup to print the paper and also to sell some supplements there. So when I reach there now, it's already getting late. I told my colleague that let's have let's um, have the red zone start going. She said okay then she, she's not done. I said I see you nights nice, don't come in. Start going. So that the people have not the thing finished. Even around all this nine ten that time. So I thought that I said, now you don't come, I want to go, I want to go. Now that I leave her, I enter a vehicle and come to that level of the store to Elios. When I reach that Elios now, I now stop there, now I call her number. If her number is going, her number will switch off. I try her number, switch off. So I was not standing at that same Elios run about side. So there's a boy. I came to me and asked him that why am I standing? I went, if I'm, I'm not afraid. I told him, no, that I should go. I don't want to talk to him. So the way people were stealing back, dragging back, also fighting. So I now called him, but like, please don't be offended. Can you help me with your phone? So I can call my colleague if the number can go. The number was still switch off. I said, okay. So, um, please, uh, can you assist me for a, a place to stay? I say, you know, say that he's not staying around there, but there is a friend, a friend of him, that normally stay here, and he can take me to that place. I say, okay, that we are two, if he can assist both of us. He said, okay. So, reason that night, I was not trying her number. Her number was switched off. I tried her number, her number was switched off. So I had slept there. When I slept there, then the boy, the boy now started to stop me. He told him that she leave me alone. She leave me alone. So the friend of him now, who should take me to that place? The friend now now told and now said that, oh boy, is me the pet the girl? You know where are you know go fix sleep with this girl one time. So the friend now. Which is the one that's staying there. Now, slap me and push me in the bed. So, the friend now that took me to the house, now slept with me. And when he slept with me too, the other one, I don't even know because lot of them was holding me. Now, close the door, but it was in the night around four. Around four that it happened. So, so then now, uh, now starts dragging me. And the one that took me to the house, now slept with me. After he slept with me, the second one now slept with me again. After the other one slept with him, now that took me to the house, now slept with me, which is three times. So that's how I got pregnant. When I discovered I was pregnant, was I had, was, I don't know, I think that they did not release on me. So I went back that day. I caused them with anger. I left that day. Then, so it was three months, two months, which is okay. I now went back there on November because now I go back also. I also lost my message. And then I pushed on to this. I thought that it was infection. 
So I, I start treating the infection. Nothing. I feel like I did not see the pain. So, uh, really that November now, I went back to that place. If you are staying there. Um, when I went back to that place, I saw the boy. I was still acting the way he was acting. So that he don't know me. He don't do this. I said, ah, I know now. But I did not tell him that I was pregnant. So I left back that day. So I was now on December 25. When the doctor I saw me, I said, that say that you want to buy one of our products. Now I see that, why am I like this? Why am I weak and tired? I said, I don't know. I have not seen my period since that. I don't know what is wrong with me. That's okay. If that is the case, that I should go to doctor reports at Obunagami. So when I went there now, they gave me a card. They were not doing tests and find out that I'm pregnant. So okay. And I came back. If they can look for a way to remove the pregnancy. I thought I should go that this place they don't do they don't do abortion, they don't remove pregnancy. I beg her, she said no. So there's a lady there going to OPM. Then the lady now now said that I should come to now take me to one branch at um um this the Umocholo branch. So I went to the church and the church the church people, which is the pastor, so I should come to headquarters. That's how I came to headquarters and denounced. And when I came, they now gave me a place to stay. Also, a hospital is how I'll be taking care of myself. I just want to say, God, thank you for safe delivery and for also keeping me and my baby alive. No infants. And nothing happened to us. I just want to give God all the glory. The first day I meet, I came to the church. So the welfare, the welfare woman now took me, now raised them, now took me to um, open field so that I can be taking my medication, taking things, and be taking care of my child in open field hospital without no money, free. And we come to Antinata, when I come, they normally do me check up and do me scan, give me drugs, like anything wrong about me, I'll tell them, that's my experience. And they normally check up on me every time, every, in Antinata. After everything, they did not charge me any money. And say so now I deliver my baby. They did not charge me any money. I delivered to a normal delivery. They gave my baby to center. And after I deliver, they gave me food to eat, which is pepper soup rice. May God reward him, strengthen him, as he keep on taking care of people. May God grant his own desire and may his own long life last forevermore and no weapon shall come against him shall prosper and since he has a mind to take care of children and people who have wanted pregnancy may god keep on granting his own desire and rewarding and also reward his generation so. no, no. Dr. Jesus in action. Dr. Jesus in action. God is here.